All right, so hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Peter, and thank you guys for tuning in. So this reading this week will be for the Virgo, okay? All right, so if you guys would like to um, get my extended version, it will be on Patreon. Um, you guys could, the link is below. So if you guys want to become a Patreon, um, the information is below. So we're gonna go ahead and get started and see what the ancestors have for the Virgo. You know, it's been a lot going on in this new energy. So like, like we, I stated last week, it's time for us to drop off some of those old things that were holding us back because one thing in this the Libra energy, what you want to do is you want it to um, release any, any old things that could have come back to bite you in the butt, you know, because the Libra energy was about balance, you know. And so with that moon, some, um, my moon ritual, I ended up doing, a, a, I wrote down a list um, of things that I really wanted to accomplish, you know. And so my husband and I both actually did a moon ritual. So I hope you guys wrote down some things that you wanted to do, you know, you know, spoke to say some things that you really wanted to accomplish in this season. So let's see what the ancestors have for the Virgo, okay? So, alrighty, Virgo. Let's see. All right, Virgo. All right, so Virgo, it's time for you guys to leap. It's time for you guys to spring forward, all right, and see your seeds grow. So, Virgo, you guys have been on a creative path this season, all right? You guys have been doing some of the things that were considered to others the unthinkable, but they have worked out for you. So now it's time for you to spring forward. It's time for you to leap in that faith. Whatever it is that you were desiring to do that may have seemed impossible for you, go ahead and leap into it because it is that time for you guys because you guys, Virgo, have done the work. Okay, so those seeds that you planted, they're going to start growing and they're going to grow like wildflowers, okay? This is your season. And know that you are not alone in this, Virgo. The ancestors are really guiding you. They really want you to see this thing through, whatever this thing is. So if you're involved in a business endeavor and you planted those seeds this season, I'm telling you guys, over the next two weeks, you're going to see a quick shift in your businesses and your family life and your whatever this thing that you've been working on and you've been planting it to. And the ancestors are going to guide you. You see, the guardian angels are here. And they want you to know that you are not alone in this, Virgo. This is your season. This is your time. So you need to do whatever it is that they um, laid out for you. And be graceful in your movements and actions. Okay? So now that they're guiding you, which they were always guiding you, but they're really pushing for you in this season like it's more than it's, it's a bigger push than before they want you to be graceful in your movements and your actions now you don't have to be so hasty because this is what they've been saying they've been saying to do the work over and over and over again you know and you guys have applied everything that the ancestors have told you to do and so now it's time for you to reap the reward and so because you're reaping the reward of it you don't have to do it so fast anymore you can do it as gracefully as you want, you know, and it's, it's still going to do what it was designed to do. It's still going to evolve in the way that it was uh, designed to evolve. And you see how he's studying the fruit before he uh, makes his next step. And you see how the grasshopper is just sitting there symbolically on his hands. So look at that, the Shalom master, right? And he's just being graceful in his movement. So the ancestors are backing you 100% for go, okay? All right, and so honor your inner knowing. Hey, Virgo, so what it's saying is you already know what it is that you need to do. The medicine mother is here. You know what it is that you need to do, Virgo. There is, you You have it on the inside of you, and you need to honor that. You need to trust that you have everything it takes to fulfill this destiny, okay? So honor that inner knowing, Virgo. And then you hear, 
and the information is going to come to you. The ancestors are going to send the information your way in some of the weirdest ways. So while you're meditating, probably why some of you are praying, whatever it is, however you receive your information for your creator, that's how it's going to come to you. And you're going to know that information is coming. It's going to be important. And, and you're going to know exactly what it is that you need to do with it, Virgo. So it's time. I'm so happy for you guys. Connect with your emotions. There's going to be some things that's coming in. And you're going to have to connect with your emotions, but that's okay. That's okay. Some of you guys are working on businesses that require your emotions to be involved a little bit, and that's okay. But it's all going to work out for its greater good. So, I, I mean, you guys have an amazing reading. Like, the ancestors are really on your side with this. And the water guardian is there to help you connect with those emotions when it comes to this thing. But it's not going to be like a, a, a bad em emotional trauma or anything like that. I don't want you thinking that. I'm saying that like your emotions are going to be in line for, for this particular thing. So lately you've been feeling exhausted. Lately you've been feeling hate, you know. You know, just kind of out of energy, you know, a bit drained, but you're going to end up being able to connect with your emotions really quick and then just move past it, okay? So that 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 loss of energy feeling that you've been feeling, that drainage that you've been feeling, that tiredness, that fatigue that you've been feeling, it's going to go away. So I'm just so excited to see that you guys have, you know, pretty much done done the work you know the virgos you guys have done the work so that's pretty much it for you guys you're about to spring into something big and when you spring into this, this thing big it's gonna it's gonna bless your life in a way that you didn't even believe it was possible for it to bless your life in that way and it's gonna elevate you to a certain level and so once you elevate to that level you're not gonna have to work so hard and so fast no more you can do it gracefully and it's gonna have the same impact as if you were running you know, you was hitting the ground running. It's going to have the same impact in, in that way. And then you, because you, you're in tune with yourself, you're going to know yourself enough to know that the decisions that you're making are going to be the right decision. And the ancestors are going to filter you the information that you need to move this thing right along. You're going to be, able, you're going to stop feeling tired and you're going to be able to connect with those emotions, connect with those feelings. And all of that is going to be done with the push of your guardian angels because your ancestors will guide you the entire way so thank you virgos i really appreciate you guys for tuning in i know that this reading was really quick but um there is an extended version of this reading if you guys want to check it out it'll be on a patreon account if you like the content on this page go ahead and hit like comment and subscribe and i really appreciate you guys for tuning in